I was not happy with my smile and my dad had a big gap and I was always told you look like your dad and my dad wasn't necessarily a positive role model or figure in my life and so I think I was relating my smile to my dad and I wanted to change that because I wasn't happy with that overall aura of looking like my dad and so when I did make the decision to get braces I started getting excited and um, just recently um, I met a gentleman and the first thing he said to me was I love your smile and I just went through all the emotions and thought about you know my orthodontist and the experience I went through my history and everything and I was like this guy does not know what I've gone through to get here to say thank you I, I really love my smile too now you know and so it, it's exciting to have now at the age of 52 have someone look in your face and say that they love your smile. I enjoyed the staff, I had a good time, and I really look forward to coming to every visit. I was a little hesitant at first because I put three children through braces, so I kind of knew a little bit, but I knew that um, I wanted my smile straight. So. I wasn't happy with my smile before braces, and as I went through the process, I began to get more excited about the end result, and I love my smile today. I no longer have to hide my smile, which I wasn't comfortable with before, but now I'm excited about my smile and excited about polishing my teeth and um, just being in front of people and being happy and just showing my dimples and my teeth. Oh, Dr. Chamberlain, I love him. He's wonderful. His personality is awesome. The, the whole staff, the office is just, it's just a... A great experience. I mean, I'm 50 something years old, but I come in with the little kids and I'm just as excited as they are. <laughs> well, basically, if it's something that you want to do or something that you're not happy with about yourself, there's opportunities out there to make change. And braces for me was that opportunity. That was the one thing that I wasn't happy with. So it was a small price to pay for the rest of my life to be happy with my face that I have to look in the mirror with every day. And I would just encourage whatever it is to pursue it and do it until you're happy.